Here's the reality of the situation. Everyone is in a maze and they are all trapped. Yet they neglect this truth because it would be too overwhelming to accept. And the most comical part of it all, perhaps the most insidious part of it all, is that they think they are free. Isn't that such a wonderful thing? To deceive someone so completely that they are willing to spend the rest of their lives in shackles rather than face the possibility of being wrong. Yeah, this is creepy. I'm out. There was a door here a minute ago. If you had any sense, you'd be much more afraid right now. Yeah, see, I'm a Christian, right? So what you're saying doesn't really scare me. What does scare me are your eyes. They're so lifeless. So how do I get out of here? Let me break this down for you. We work like dogs, day and night, to pay for houses we can't afford, to buy cars to impress people who are irrelevant players in our lives. We work and work and work every single day, giving away our time, our youth, our sanity, all to survive. But here's the point, I'm getting to it. We use the weekend to escape this reality, so we turn to our passions, our hedonistic pleasures, our addictions, and we idolize them and we call them our savior. <laughs> See, we think we are in control when they control us. That's the punchline. <laughs> Sorry, uh, you can continue with your creepy monologue. I'm just trying to get out of here. If you'd like to leave, then simply wake up. <coughs> Whoa, that was creepy. What was... <laughs>